Pixie Show! Yay! Hi, Fred here. Today, it's time we take a look at something a little bit unique. But, <laughs> it might be a little bit controversial, but I gotta do what I gotta do. Today, we're gonna be taking a look at Bring it, please! Likings and criticisms! Oh, doesn't that sound like fun? Yeah! Hey! It's my job to make sure you understand this! Okay! Good! Because here we go! YouTube is obviously the most well-known place ever. And here's a lot of the things that people talk about on YouTube. Here, they think that Steven Universe is good, SpongeBob is so-so, and Two Titans Go is bad. Hmm. Talk about one-dimensional people. But this, oh, this would be all in my opinion. Now that is more like it. <laughs> I'm kind of mad on Teen Titans Go. I hate Steven Universe and I love SpongeBob. One other thing I heard other YouTubers talk about and rant about is something called Disney live action remakes. This is when Disney takes one of their classic films like Dumbo, Beauty and the Beast, Aladdin, um, even The Lion King of all things, and reimagines it with a more edgy script, uh, some unique celebrity actors, I'm assuming, and, well, basically the same plot of the original, and just makes a live action. That's basically what it is. But look at this chart! Watch what happens. Yo, <laughs> kaboom! See? Look at all the hate that these remakes have. Something tells me that no YouTuber likes the Disney live-action remakes. Personally, I'm not a fan myself. But I don't despise it like they do. They violently despise it. To the point where they just want to kill themselves. But you know what? I'm not like those people. I'm just, meh, they tried. I guess... The writers and directors of the remix just hated the original script or something. Oh well. However, there is one exception. Now, if any of you YouTubers are watching this, please understand this. The very first Disney live action remake was 1996's 101 Dalmatians. Starring Glenn Close as Cruella de Vil. This was actually promoted by a sing-along tape that I'll talk about, hopefully, in some other episode. But one thing you should understand is that they've got real animals in this movie. Real animals! Such great actors those dogs were. And I especially love puppies. Anyway, moving forward, here's a list of my YouTubers. Well, my YouTuber list, that is. This is a list of my favorite YouTubers, my despised YouTubers, and my now. YouTubers. Now I understand that when I look at these, well, when I look back at some YouTube videos, 
some other YouTube videos by other YouTubers. I noticed that they seem to complain a lot about, you know, animated films nowadays. You know, Disney live action remakes and stuff. They even talk about non-Disney animated studios. And they just give them the most negative, unpositive feedback ever. I mean, when was the last time you ever saw a positive response to something that wasn't, well, anyone who I actually watch? But, well, <laughs> we all have our own opinions, but, I mean, has anyone ever liked the Emoji Movie? Has anyone hated Frozen? I don't know. It just depends on how well they are able to do something. Yes, this is all my opinion. I like to call this sweaty, dark, obsessed weirdo, weird sweaty man with weird hat, the most violent guy with trench coat, and probably the meanest guy on earth. Oh, that was a relief. <laughs> I finally let it out after all these years. Oh, I feel so young again. I, I just hope that you understand. This is all my opinion. But these YouTubers, oh my gosh, they're awesome. They may be amateur YouTubers, but I gotta say, this one's my favorite. Please subscribe to our channel. <laughs> oh, who am I kidding? You're already watching it. <laughs> anyway, I'm pretty sure you understood everything. Remember, everyone has their own opinion. Sometimes they feel different about things. And I want to tell you something. You are the only you. You're the only you. And I'm the only me. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. I couldn't resist. That song's been stuck in my head for weeks. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. See you later. And we'll see you on another episode of The Sprixie Show. Bye.